How to love your job. Loving your job can be hard, especially if you are bored by your work or if you do not feel appreciated. If you are finding it hard to love what you do, there are several ways that you can develop a more positive attitude towards work. To start loving your job, you can do things like developing an attitude of gratitude, making friends at the office, and talking to your boss about a raise. With time and effort, you may start to find that you are looking forward to work rather than dreading it. Changing your outlook. Change the way that you work. Maybe you need to use a new technique or change your approach in order to love your job. When work becomes mundane, it can feel more difficult to face. In these situations, changing your approach might be helpful. This is sometimes called job enrichment. Look for little opportunities to change up your routine at work. Making small changes may make work feel more fun and help keep things fresh. For example, if you are a teacher, try a new lesson plan now and then or test out a new teaching strategy. If you are a cashier, try asking each customer a different question to make small talk. Look for little opportunities to change up your routine at work. Making small changes may make work feel more fun and help keep things fresh. For example, if you are a teacher, try a new lesson plan now and then or test out a new teaching strategy. If you are a cashier, try asking each customer a different question to make small talk. Focus the positive aspects of your job. If you are not enjoying your job, then you might be focused on all of the negative aspects of it. To start loving your job, you will need to identify what you like about your job and start focusing on those positive aspects instead. Try writing down all of the things that you like about your job. These can be small or big things. For example, you might like your hours, your coworkers, your responsibilities, and the location of your workplace. Try reading through this list whenever you are feeling down about your job. Try writing down all of the things that you like about your job. These can be small or big things. For example, you might like your hours, your coworkers, your responsibilities, and the location of your workplace. Try reading through this list whenever you are feeling down about your job. Practice gratitude. If you find that you are having negative thoughts about going to work each day, try keeping a list of the things that you are grateful for. Practicing gratitude can help you to feel happier overall and may also help you see your job in a more positive light. Try listing three things that you are grateful for at the end of each day. For example, you might feel grateful that your boss brought donuts into work for everyone, or that you got to work at your favorite station that day, or simply that you have a job. Try listing three things that you are grateful for at the end of each day. For example, you might feel grateful that your boss brought donuts into work for everyone, or that you got to work at your favorite station that day, or simply that you have a job. Look at the big picture. Sometimes work may become a chore if little things start to bother you more than they should. If you find yourself focusing in on minor issues at work, such as a rude customer or making a mistake, remind yourself that these are not important in the grand scheme of things. One way to put problems into perspective is to ask yourself, will I be thinking about this moment while I am on my deathbed? If the answer is no, then it is not worth your mental energy now either. One way to put problems into perspective is to ask yourself, will I be thinking about this moment while I am on my deathbed? If the answer is no, then it is not worth your mental energy now either. Improve other parts of your life. Sometimes a job can be more difficult to engage with when other parts of your life are out of balance. Consider other aspects of your life that might be making you unhappy. For example, are you having any relationship problems? Are you having financial difficulties? Do you feel depressed for no apparent reason? If you are struggling with something, seek help from a friend or family member or talk to a therapist. For example, are you having any relationship problems? Are you having financial difficulties? Do you feel depressed for no apparent reason? If you are struggling with something, seek help from a friend or family member or talk to a therapist. 